Hello everyone, Gmoed JP. Today we're gonna be evolving Hilda's uh, toe pig. I just got her not too long ago. I actually got lucky. So I figured why not make a video just evolve it. So we'll start off with her story and then we'll go from there. So a day with Hilda. So hey, Jimo J, can I ask you a favor? What's up? <laughs> There's something that's bothering me. Apparently my fake gets really angry whenever I battle. Sometimes, just sometimes, the other trainers and their pro won't get a little scared of me. I gotta see this. Okay, let's try this out. Look close. So what do you think, Jimo? Was my face a little off-putting? No, of course not. Really, oh, thank goodness. Mm. But that, because I wonder what the trainer and Pomo were so scared of. <laughs> then again, I don't think I'm putting on your game face during a battle. If necessary, it's a bad thing. Mm. You have to get serious during battles or you lose. <laughs> Besides, I have a lot of writing on my battles. I know Topri understands that as we are battling together. The relationship between trainer and the Poma is hard to define. Arguably, the one and only thing that defines a relationship with a Poma is their Pokeball. So I can see this side in Fickle. That's, yeah, but... I know I don't think our relationship with our Poma is as cold as that either. But I remember these guys who called themselves Team Plasma back in the Genova region. <laughs> they will make a fuss about we should liberate the Pokemon from their Pokeballs. I do remember that. I guess that's all as it's unslaving that Pokemon using a Pokeballs. <laughs> so if I was able to form a bond so strong that neither trainer nor Pokemon would be bothered by the Pokeballs. Maybe if we can do that, we wouldn't have blackheads like that jumping to the wrong conclusion. You have a point there. So, all in all, trainers and Pongo have their own wants and desires and goals. As long as all the love can see, that means two of you are strongly connected. In that case, you can work together whether or not there is a Pokeball, right? So I sat down and got to thinking about what makes a really strong bond. I like Pokemon battles and Tope likes Pokemon battles. But we don't see to lose and why we try darnest to make sure we win. <laughs> Gotta love Hilda, seriously. We need to say that a strong connection. If we are that saint that should mean that we both want to win that PML Pokemon League the same way, right? I'm sure Tope would choose that right move if I didn't give that instruction. Nah. Right Tope, if you were to use a move right at the moment, you choose Flame Charge, right? <laughs> totally insane. I know, right? I'm so glad we're partners. Nah. I bet seeing how sync we are makes you even more excited to battle with us, huh? I wouldn't know because I'm really excited to battle you too. You and your Pokemon are in the same mind, just like Togepi and me. <laughs> I couldn't ask for a better opponent. So when we do better, show us how you synchronize you and your Pokemon. So that's that first part. And now we're going to evolve it, her Togepi. So here we go, level, evolution chart, so evolution chart times 5, use this item to join venture, this item will be returned if you don't, not complete, okay. Bone will evolve upon complete, yes, it's okay. Uh oh, Flannery, people always tell me that they know what I'm thinking just by looking at my face. <laughs> That's true, I bet I can totally guess what you're thinking right now. <laughs> I really want to talk though. 
not very good at like trying to outwit somebody with tricky moves in a battle either. Just go straight to the opponent when it comes time for a problem battle. Every time works out if you just push through hard as you can. Let's see how you two can make a problem battle get. Okay, but do you really think you can stop us? I really driven to win. So here we go. Of course I'm overpowered. Level 100. We won. You defeated Flannery. Oh, you and Topic are right over us. That was about as hot as a battle can get. You and Toko were pretty awesome too. I thought you had use there. I think both of you is easy to read, just prove how passionate we are about Pokemon. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe you're right, we shouldn't be embarrassed, we should be proud. <laughs> Tempura, what's happening? Oh, you're evolving, alright, now you can grow even more. Oh. Congrats, just take Pig Evolve into Pig Knight. A <laughs> Pig Knight. So now to do the third form. So I need to get charts. Says you cannot. So I'm missing. So well, let's get that on the way real quick. I got the money for it, so... Okay, so shop... Exchange... So I guess it's a general item... Should be... No... I don't even know which one was it, this one or this one? I think it was... Okay, there it is, Evolution Crystal... I think... I'll take I think I only need one of these just to be sure I'll take one of these so back to sync pair Okay, so it was a big one. Hello there, Hilda. Look like you've been working hard, huh? Sharon. Yeah, we meet all kinds of trainers and battle them all. With now Pig Knight and I are much stronger. Oh well, if that's the case, then perhaps we should see who's the strongest between us. You got it, I'll give that everything I got. Everything I've seen on my bench, everything I've felt, I'm putting it all on the winning this battle. That's what I want to hear, I want to see you really break out of your shell and go for it. Yeah, let's, we got this.
Oh wow, that was strong. Yes, we won. Of course. Now I see you are as strong as not even stronger than I heard. It's not just about raw power. Trust and Pig9 have each, each other precisely why you're able to perform at so well. <laughs> yeah, we've been through so much together after all. <laughs> well, you got me. I'm looking forward to seeing just how strong you two can get. <laughs> wow, Pig9, you're evolving. Shan did say we break out our shell. I guess this is the way to do it. Congrats, Pink Knight evolved into Ambrose. You think most battle fanatic. Hill crush. And that's pretty much it for this video. That that's it. 